Stop scrolling. Fighter jets worth $400 million are being destroyed on the ground before they even take off. Runways have become death traps. Right now, China is watching every American air base in the Pacific, calculating missile strikes that could wipe out our entire air force in 12 minutes. But what if aircraft could launch from any highway, parking lot, or forest clearing? The Pentagon just cracked an 80-year problem, and by the end of this video, you'll see why America's enemies are terrified of what's coming in 2026. Hit subscribe because this changes everything about air combat. Runways are military graveyards. Israel destroyed 290 Egyptian aircraft on the ground in three hours during the 1967 Six-Day War. Not in aerial combat, just sitting on runways. Today, this vulnerability is catastrophic. A single runway at Kadena Air Base costs $200 million, but can be destroyed by a $2 million missile in seconds. China has 1,500 ballistic missiles aimed at Pacific bases, each capable of cratering runways with pinpoint accuracy. War games show American forces lose 90% of aircraft on the ground in the first 48 hours of Pacific conflict. XBAT eliminates this vulnerability entirely because it doesn't need runways at all. But the mobile launch capability solves an even bigger problem that most people don't realize exists. The mobile launch revolution. Sweden's Gripen fighter operates from highway strips requiring just 800 meters of road and six crew members, but it still needs prepared pavement. XBAT launches vertically from a mobile truck platform requiring only a tennis court size clearing. Set up in a parking lot, forest clearing, or ship deck in under an hour. The launcher positions XBAT vertically, throttles to maximum afterburner, and the aircraft rockets straight up like it's leaving a launch pad. Landing reverses the process. XBAT performs a Cobra maneuver, transitions from horizontal to vertical flight, and lands back on the mobile platform like a bird on a branch. This means XBAT can operate from thousands of potential locations that change daily, making it impossible for enemies to predict or target launch sites. But mobility is worthless if your navigation systems stop working in combat. When GPS dies completely, Russia jams GPS across Ukraine's entire front line constantly, rendering satellite-dependent weapons useless. During 2022 NATO exercises in Finland, Russian jamming disabled precision-guided systems across entire regions. The U.S. military built 30 years of weapons assuming GPS always works, while adversaries spent those years learning to shut it down. XBAT operates using AI-powered visual navigation that doesn't need GPS. Cameras and sensors build real-time terrain maps, identifying targets and navigating through completely jammed environments. The AI recognizes features from millions of trained images without external signals. XBAT completes missions, finds targets, engages threats, and returns to base even when every satellite is blocked. This autonomous capability extends beyond navigation into something far more threatening for adversaries. Swarm intelligence takes over. China demonstrated 200 drones launching simultaneously in 2021, self-organizing into attack formations without human input. One operator gave an objective, the swarm figured out execution. XBAT brings this to fighter jet level with multiple aircraft coordinating attacks autonomously. One XBAT handles targeting while others stay passive, then all engage simultaneously from different angles. If one gets destroyed, others instantly adjust and continue. There's no single command center to attack because each XBAT makes independent decisions while coordinating through secure networks. 10 XBATs cost less than maintaining one traditional fighter squadron, but create exponentially more dilemmas for enemies defending against distributed threats coming from unpredictable locations. But the real combat advantage comes from removing human physical limitations entirely. Physics has no mercy. Human pilots black out at 9 Gs. F-16 airframes can structurally handle 12 Gs, but are limited to 9 because higher forces kill pilots. XBAT has no such restrictions. The AI executes sustained 12 plus G turns that would be instantly fatal to humans, outturning any manned aircraft in dogfights. Human reaction time is 250 milliseconds. XBAT's AI reacts in under 50 milliseconds. That 200 millisecond advantage determines who shoots first and who survives. Human pilots fatigue after 90 minutes of intense combat flying. 
XBAT maintains maximum performance for eight continuous hours. The aircraft carries internal weapons bays and external hardpoints for air-to-air -air missiles, precision bombs, and anti-ship weapons. It has onboard sensors and electrical generation power to close kill chains independently without relying on external targeting data. This isn't replacing human judgment, it's removing physical constraints that get people killed. The deterrence equation changes. XBAT costs one-tenth the life cycle cost of traditional fifth-generation fighters. An F-35 costs $400 million over its lifetime, including maintenance, infrastructure, and 1,200 support personnel per squadron. XBAT's mobile operation eliminates permanent runways, massive hangars, and climate-controlled maintenance facilities worth billions. AI pilots eliminate $10 million training costs per human aviator. Small crews of 20 people support multiple XBATS from mobile platforms. For the same budget that maintains one F-35 squadron, the military fields 10 times as many XBATs operating from anywhere without vulnerable home bases. This changes deterrence completely. Adversaries can't destroy air power by targeting fixed bases because there are no fixed bases. They can't jam navigation because XBAT doesn't need satellites. They can't win air superiority through attrition because XBATS costs dramatically less to replace and no pilots die. First vertical flight tests happen in 2026. Full combat capability arrives in 2028. Within three years, air power becomes untethered from runways forever and every piece of Earth truly becomes a potential launch site. XBAT represents the biggest shift in air combat since the jet engine replaced propellers. When runways become irrelevant and aircraft launch from anywhere, the entire strategic map gets redrawn. If this technology reaches full deployment by 2028, we're watching the future of warfare being built right now. Smash that subscribe button and hit the notification bell because this is just number one on the list and what's coming next will blow your mind even more.